Hello there, duct tape like Mad Eleven here, and this is craft update number five. Whoa, that's Sharpie. Okay, so this craft date is really big, and I'm just gonna like show you what there is here. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff. So I'm gonna have to go pretty fast. I'm not really gonna be able to explain each product, but yeah, it's the best I can do. And excuse me for all of that junk back there. Okay, so I'm just gonna start fresh. There might be a lot of price tags on things, like right here. Because of how um, I'm having rummage sales soon, so I need I'm selling my stuff, so I'm just pricing them right now. Yeah. So I made two continuous flower rose pens. They're one's um, blue leopard, blue cheetah, whatever, and the other one's neon hound's tooth. Yeah. I made this eight strand um, braided bracelet, electric blue, dark blue, denim, and chrome. Yeah, I really like it. Um, I have this comic book. Um, I tried to line it up as best as I could. I was kind of rushing. Dude, I used seven strips of tape trying to line this up. Speaking of embarrassing, okay. Anyway, it's like this little journal that I decided to make. So, like, it's this new prototype, and it basically looks like this. Um, I used cardstock paper for good, um, you know, like durability, and I clear taped it. And then I kind of just like taped over it with this. And all I did was take some paper, fold it, and then cut it, staple it together, and then hot glue gun it into this little seam that I made right here. So yeah, there's like that box thing right there. Yeah, so I really like it. It's really nice. Let's not get to record all my stuff in it. Um, yeah, I'm gonna make some of this. Okay. Then I have, I'm really not going in order by the product, I'm just doing stuff. So this is this um, wallet that I made that has cotton candy clouds um, and electric blue. I'm going to turn on my light here. Whoa. Alright. Yeah. Sorry about that. I don't really like that there. Okay. Yeah. So I have this wallet that's like chrome electric blue and cotton candy clouds. The inside is um, electric blue with chrome and... The back is clear tape to something, which is Hershey wrappers. And I really like them be with the chrome because it gives it that shiny look. The only problem is I got a little wrinkle. <laughs> yeah, so I really like it. It's awesome. All. And then I'm just going to do all the buy other bifolds right now, too. Um, this one has comic book. I was too lazy to line it up. The inside is dark blue, and th the bottom is clear taped. And the inside is four card pockets, and this is my business card holder. It was one of my first ones that I made, so it's really crappy. I'll talk about that at the end. And all the pockets are clear tape, too. Yeah. And then I have one that's similar to it, Gummy Bear. The inside is Atomic Yellow, with no sticky at the bottom. And then it has um, silver glitter and yellow trim. Yeah, I'll show you that business card in a minute. Then I have this wrapping paper, leftover wrapping paper that I found, and I basically cut it to the right length and clear taped it. And on the inside, I put rainbow and chrome, and I really love this color combo. Like, I'm in love with it, like, seriously. And I just love how it looks so good with the chrome and the electric blue, and especially with, like, this wrapping paper on the front. Oh, yeah, and, yeah. and then the inside is chrome, and the bottom is clear taped. And then this is all clear taped, too. I didn't have to make that annoying noise. I have no idea. Okay, and then now we're going to the good stuff. So this is this um, graphic store wallet. It's all lined up on the outside. And I'm starting to make mine like shorter than the other. I don't know why I'm doing that, but it's really weird. Um, and the inside is blue and gold, and the bottom is graphic swirl. But then the inside, I have electric blue and gold. Um, three card pockets, a hidden. And then I have a pocket here. Um, this ID and then a pocket behind it and then hidden. I was trying to do the thing where you can like slide it in but I realized I didn't have the right measurements of the ID because I'm abnormally stupid. Oh yeah, and there's a hidden too. Yeah. But then I did it the right way. So this is all clear taped. It's Scotty Dogs. The, the billfold is gold and white and it's all clear taped. So is the bottom. Then the inside 
has all the pockets which are clear taped, every single one, and it's gold and white. And I did like this cool design on them, like try cutting them, but I don't really like it. And then there's a hidden, and then another hidden, and I think the inside of the hiddens are gold, whatever. And then there's um, a pocket here, a pocket here, and then the slide in, which I figure out how to do the right way. And while I'm doing this, I'm just going to show you my business card. I just printed it out online on Comes Cardstock because I didn't really feel like ordering them, so. Yeah. And then if you're wondering why, like, the ID looks really weird, was because I also experimented with using clear tape as an ID, and I really didn't get all the bubbles out, so that was a big mistake. So I'm not going to try that again. <laughs> yeah, but it was really fun to make. And then I have this trifle. It's gummy bears on the outside, and then the inside has dark blue and electric blue. It has two vertical park pockets, a hidden, um, this like band, um, an ID, and um, two more card pockets over here, and it's blue on the inside, and the bottom is clear taped. Okay. And then I have this woman's wallet. It's um. <laughs> wavy green. I'm just gonna like hold my tripod here. It's wavy green and it's all lined up and clear taped. And the inside has chrome trim and dark blue. And I'm not really gonna go in depth here, but yeah. It has an ID here and yeah, and two billfolds. I have to hustle. I'm already at six minutes. Oh boy. Okay. And then I have this blue prototype. It's, sorry about that yelling in the background, those are my siblings. I have this blue leopard wallet. It has like, it's this new prototype. It has like this pouch in the front, you can put anything, and then there's card pockets on the back. And then there's a Ziploc coin pouch thing on the top. So it's kind of a cross between an inside out wallet and I don't know what else. And then I have this mini accordion wallet. It's rainbow, all lined up. And inside is atomic yellow, or just yellow. I don't know why I just called it atomic yellow, but yeah. Ooh, it's overflowing. And ah, this really strong Ziploc. It's not even the Ziploc brand. It's like this blue and green. I don't know what it is, but it works really good. Yeah. I just love opening and closing Ziploc for some reason. Um, yeah. And it has the one inch expandables too. And then I have this cup holder. It's graphic swirls and electric blue. Yeah. And then I have this little cup thing using this like polka dot from the dollar store. It's really weird, but it has gold on it inside. Yeah. And then I have this rainbow wing holder. Sorry, I'm just gonna move this back. It uses like um I use paper towel roll and then I put some like cardstock around the side, around it, and wrapped it around and then duct tape it so it's really sturdy. And yeah. Yeah, and I'm selling it and it comes with one bracelet too. Now I'm going to go on to the stuff I'm selling on my Etsy. So I'm just going to like move the tripod over here. Okay. Spotlight. Alright. So I have an Etsy account and I'm going to put the link in the description below. And so I'm just going to briefly go over these. Um, this one's Neon Houndstooth Electric Blue and Chrome. It has two card pockets and a V-shaped pocket. Um, the inside is all chrome and there's no sticky at the bottom. And the back is Neon Houndstooth as well. And I think this is like a dollar and twenty-five cents. And then this is a BD bracelet. It's retro owls and dark blue, and you can fit it on your arm and stuff. Yay! All right. And then, yeah. And the, oh, and it's also the stretchable band stuff, so it can fit on anybody's hand, basically. Oh, yeah. And then I have like this pencil topper thing. Um, credit ID credit goes to Silver Cats Crafts. Um, she came up with this really awesome idea. By using these um, pencil topper things that you usually use, you can like put that on and wrap duct tape around it and make this flower that you can put on your pencils. So like this, you can put it on top of your pencil and write with it and then when you want to erase, you take the top off and you do your little erasing deal and you put it back on like that. Yeah. And it's really awesome. I think this is like 75 cents plus shipping. And then they have this wavy green and electric blue ruffle coin pouch with Ziploc. 
and blue on the inside. And yeah. Okay, and then I'm also going to give you guys a special offer since you watched this. I'm going to let you guys, um, if you go on my Etsy, you can contact me and um, uh, type down the code um, duct tape rules. Um, just like duct tape rules, you know. So just type down duct tape rules and I will give you a 25% off discount since you watched my YouTube video. So, thank you guys all for watching this gigantic craft update, and I'll see you next time. Oh, yeah, and there's my scrapple. Bye!